All right, guys, welcome back to the Bro Show. And today, you see behind us, we have the new Jeepo flavor. Clickbait came in yesterday, so today we met up, time to film it, and I'm really excited to try it, actually. Yeah, for sure. I've been super stoked. I'm excited for it because I feel like it's going to be one of those flavors that are like, you know, like Nemesis Tea, Pewds flavor, uh, Shiny Splash for A Drive, like one of those neutral flavors that's very refreshing and something that I like to drink like every day because right. I've gone through like a whole Shiny Splash tub like two Nemesis tea tubs, a PewDiePie tub. So this flavor guys is called clickbait for a reason. And you guys will see on the B-roll that will throw up on the screen right now. On the box, there is some like, there's, you can notice like a few fruits that are around the name, such as like the cherry and the pomegranate. There's also some other fruits thrown in, in the box, such as like an orange, a banana, and maybe I think a watermelon uh, that may be on the actual tub itself. But the reason it's called clickbait is because you're supposed to not really know what fruit is going to be or what what the flavor is actually going to be like what fruit is based on um that's the whole name and the whole purpose of clickbait uh, a lot of youtubers use it um for you know like as a thumbnail i guess or as a title so you'll click on the video and it may be something completely different than what the actual video shows or says you guys can see right here there's a pomegranate right here there's a cherry um if you look uh let's see where's that Let's see. It well, I guess on the front too here. There's an orange over there too. Yeah, orange here. There's like a, a grapefruit looking whatever the thing that is there. Um, right there. And what the else is on here? There's a few other fruits on here. There's banana here hiding on the front down here at the bottom. But like we said, um, the two main flavors that are shown on the box around the name is a cherry and a pomegranate. So we already got uh, shakers with ice and water in them. And you have your tub behind me here, so. All right, so there's a tub, so obviously you can tell it's obviously full, brand new. It's obviously brand new, there's boxes, we're not lying about it, so let's go ahead and open it up. There it is, opened up now. I kind of tore it a little too far down, but it doesn't matter, the name is still showing, so. Let's go. Right, I'll sit my back here again. Oh, it's kind of loose, I don't see what I need to Oh no, as long as that's sealed though. There it is, open it up, obviously brand new tub, so kabammy. I think focus, that's neat. There you go, boom. Looks like cherries at the butt, honestly. Nice. Looks like sour cherry, honestly. Does it? Well, it looks like a cherry sucker. That's really good. It's, it's very cherry, honestly. Oh, that is very cherry. As I'm getting a hint of pomegranate, too. Those guys, I love pomegranate, so. I don't see the scoop on top, though. Rip. And always guys, we always tear the funnel off of the scoops just because they are for water bottles and we use G Fuel shakers, which the fill line for one scoop is at that fill line there. So obviously this whole thing here from the bottom to the top. So yep. that's one little scoop. One there we scoop. go. Got one full scoop there. Go ahead and get it in your water there. And guys, we are using the new shakers and we're not using a clear shaker. That way we're able to see uh, or I mean, that way, it's like it's like obviously cherry color. Yeah, so we won't be able to show it's you the exact color. Basically, pomegranate but... red. You know, what pomegranate red is like that's pomegranate red. Yeah. It's like a, a dark cherry red. Too. You can see through the shaker that it is red. So. Yeah. Yeah, you can tell it's a red tint to that now. All right, guys, we got our scoop in here, uh, and we're gonna get ready to shake it up. But I know you want to mention something too, really quick. About yeah, the shakers. Yeah, uh, if you guys didn't notice when we showed you the shaker up close and obviously in the B-roll, uh, obviously it just says G Fuel here. There's no energy flow at the bottom. It's probably and uh, if you, the reason why, because obviously this is a high detailed uh, logo there. So obviously yeah, you just show you, you that one there. Yeah, I'll show you guys in butter shaker. You guys can see down under the G Fuel Because most, most, every shaker you get energy will flow. always say energy foam, but these, I guess, are so high detailed on this is the word G Fuel. Yeah, I, that's what I heard. I mean, it'll look cool with the down there black or purple, but it's still cool either way. Yeah, I just heard they kept it out of these shakers just because, you know, they couldn't really get all that really high quality detail that small. But all right, well, we got our scoops in here. I'm ready to get it shaken up and give it a smell and get a taste, you know? There you go. Pal, it's all mixed up. I'm excited to smell it, you know? 
Right, all right, so we got first open and tell, we got the real strong cherry, cherry burst of smell. So yeah. now, and a little I'm, bit of pomegranate. I'm kind of excited to see what this is gonna smell like. Oh, did the cherry smell grow more? Did the cherry smell grow louder? Or is it more pomegranate? So we'll find out. Yeah, or maybe even anything, something else, you know, because right. again, clickbait, it's supposed to be cherry pomegranate, or so we think. So, right. all right, let's give it a smell. Okay, right off the bat, smelling just like sour cherry. It's like sour cherry, but with like a little bit more of a, a, a fruit punch smell. Right. I feel bad. Like, it kind of smells like the juice, but like not as strong juice because yeah, I'm smelling more of the cherry. It's like the juice, but way more cherry. Yeah, I'm getting more of the sour cherry smell. The more I smell it, honestly. The more I water it, it's pretty foamy too, honestly. Yeah, I was going to say, guys, I know a lot of the. Foamy that is. You can yeah, I was going to take side. this off and show them. And guys, if you don't know, <laughs> you guys can hopefully uh, see that right here. You guys can see that right there. It's very, a uh, lot purple, purplish red uh, yeah. foam because a, the new formula that they have done to make it, it is 15 calories. Yeah, the, the new 15 calorie formula um, tends to actually foam up a lot compared to their 25 calorie formula. So just thought I'd give you guys a heads up because I know I've multiple times before I figured this out. I would, you know, this is, when we get a new G Fuel flavor, I would shake it up when we try it and all that. And I'd be like, why is it so foamy? Did I leave soap in my shaker or whatever? And I would dump it out and then I would shake it again in my next scoop and I would realize, oh, it's still just as foamy. So just a heads up for any of you that pick up the new G Fuel formulas, um, which is all the new flavors now. Just just be aware that when you do shake it up, it is going to be foamy. So it's not soap or anything. So just thought I'd let you guys know that, but I'm excited to try it. Let's go ahead and give it er, a taste. Oh, that's really good. That's really good, yeah. Mm. It's like you said, almost like the PewDiePie and like other flavors. It's a good, smooth, you know, cold tasting flavor. And then when you mention PewDiePie again, it's almost kind of what it tastes like, but more of a cherry rather than a lingonberry. Right. Mm. That's so what I was expecting. It's almost like a cherry lime too. Yeah. It's a smooth flavor. It's. It, I'm, I'm actually kind of glad. That G Fuel released a cherry flavor without sourness. Yeah, it's not really sour. Like it has a. Um, if you guys have ever had a pomegranate, you know what pomegranate tastes like, or pomegranate juice. You know it kind of has like that initial, like tang slash kick whatever, um, and you get that right off. I feel like with the cherry, but it's nothing like a you know G Fuel sour cherry or the cherry and limeade. It's more of a, more of a sweet cherry aftertaste. Yeah. I get, like yeah, a, I get more of the cherry after. I get more of the pomegranate in the first, yeah. and then after is like, you know, cherry. Yeah, and in the, the cherry part too, you know what it tastes like at the end? It tastes like a cherry Jolly Rancher. True. It tastes, it tastes more of a candy cherry towards the end, like a sweet cherry right. rather than, you know, sour cherry. But it's really that's good. A, it's like a relaxing flavor. Nothing mm. like, nothing that's like excited or... You know, a pump, pump you up flavor. It's like a chill, I want my drink now flavor. It's like almost, it's almost like drinking water. It's just yeah. one every day. Yeah, and it's like, you know, if you, a lot of people I would say drink lemonade during the summer. Right. And it's like, it's like one of those drinks that you would just get to, when you're outside, you want to be refreshed. You want to, you know, just, you know, relax, get refreshed a little bit. It's, right. it's definitely one of those flavors. Right, and sure. again, if I had to compare it to any other flavors, like, like I mentioned, PewDiePie's, Nemesis Tea, Shiny Splash, even Hype Sauce a little bit. All of those are very neutral, smooth flavors, and this one's going to go right in there with it. And yeah, for sure. I would say right off, I mean, like we both already agreed on, 10 out of 10, G Fuel, you bang it on this one. Absolutely love it. But if I had to rate it in my list of, like, top five, it's definitely top three, for sure. It's in Hands my top down. five. Ha top. Hands down, yeah. top three. But, yeah, it, it's overall... They, they, you guys, G Fuel, you smashed it on this one, like straight up. Everybody has their opinions. Everybody has different taste buds, right. and this is blows my mind. It's perfect the way I expected. Is it the way you expected? I expected a cherry pomegranate drink, and that's what I got. So <laughs> right. So I mean, yeah, it, so really, really good. So I'm not really sure what I was expecting. I know when I watched Shock, obviously said that this is, I guess, a cherry pomegranate G Fuel flavor. I mean, it tastes really good. I mean, I like the cherry, like I said. I'm kind of glad that actually made a cherry flavor and not a sour cherry flavor. I know they already have a sour cherry, but I like cherry drinks myself. Mm -hmm. And this is 
knocked out of the park, honestly. Yeah, keep in mind though, about picking this flavor up, the tub is still available as I know of now, but the box is then sold out, it sold out the day of, I think like a few hours after it launched. But other than this flavor, I know this weekend, is it this weekend? Uh, I think so. Sometime in May. I don't know if it's a start or whenever, but. Oh, well, I guess we'll do an update video and let you guys know before it comes out. But if you guys heard of it, I don't know we mentioned it a while ago. Shiny Splash, it's a drives flavor. It's actually on restock. They're releasing the, I guess, the box again, right? Yeah, well, they never had the box. Oh, I actually made like, a box this time. So a shake. Wait, was there a shaker last time or not? No. So, so this time it was a box, shaker, mm -hmm. and tub. So. Yeah, guys. So, uh, yeah, I mean, there's two things because I thought you were going to add something else. So, guys. There's more? Yeah, so guys, there's heads up for this Friday, I believe. You guys will see this Wednesday, so this upcoming Friday. They are restocking this flavor, and this time they are bringing a collector's box along with a shaker. Because I know on the initial drop, they didn't release a shaker or a box. So if you guys want to pick it up Friday, it is very good. I highly recommend it as a starting flavor. Because again, along with this clickbait flavor, it is a very yeah. good, neutral, smooth flavor. So just a heads up on that. And also, just want to let you guys know that... You can still, I believe, I'm not positive, but we'll leave it in the description um, if it's still up. But just keep in mind that sometime in May, the new Sour Demon Age is going to be coming out. That's what I thought you were going to mention. Oh, no, but, I was going to mention that box. Okay, yeah. So a drives flavor is getting restocked with the collector's box and shaker. If you want it, be sure to do it super quick. Be sure to be there. I'm not sure what time. We'll keep you guys posted on Instagram. But we'll be picking it up, doing a review on it. Oh, and sure. um, one, I don't have the flavor to begin with. And I like having shakers. I love collecting the boxes as well because, you know, yeah, for sure. it's just cool to have. So. Sour Demon A, which is going to be like a Lemon Heads candy flavor. Um, it's an additional flavor added on to their Doom series, like Spicy Demon A. Also, if you like spicy flavors and you like sour, or if you like spicy Demon A, they actually also reskin that. So just keep in mind, we'll keep you guys updated on Instagram and Twitter or whatever. So um, just stay tuned because we already pre ordered the flavor. So. Whenever we get Sour Demon it in, we will be doing a review on that as well. So, For sure. again, um, clickbait, uh, tub's still available. Shaker is not available because they did not have it separate and collector's box is sold out. But tub, again, if you want to pick up the flavor, is available. I also want to bring up, too, I'm not sure if we decided fully yet. But I know we said in the last two videos, obviously it was solo videos, that um, I was going to do a review on a flavor and he was, too. The same flavor, but do like solos. But I think we just... I think we came together the other night and decided to do it both together because one, it is called the Bro Show. It's, yeah, it's so. us together, so we think it's. I mean, it is nice to sit down by ourselves and give a full blown opinion just one on one with the camera, but it's also better with us to sit down like this and yeah. do it because that's who we are. Yeah, and sure. I know we also when we filmed the go we also, also interrupt. We, I know we've done it like four or five times already in this video. So have we have? We're trying to work on it, and uh, we're gonna get yeah. better as time goes on. So we came together the other night and we're like. Yeah, it could be higher quality if we do, you know, you know, only me, only him, you know, cameras right. tend to focus better with one person, and, you know, one item rather than two people and a bigger background. Yeah, yeah, for sure. So, um, again, we came together and we were like, you know, it's it's a channel for both of us, even though it may not be as high quality as we want, we're still going to do it together because that's what makes it more fun rather than yeah, just me sure. sitting and talking to a camera or you sitting and talking to the camera. And like you said to like interrupting each other is something we do a lot it's just the habit we have and that's something honestly we're trying to work on we're trying to you know more map out on what we want to say and a lot of you guys are probably like oh why don't you just stop and edit it out well i mean it's us we kind of just want to roll and keep it you know as right. as us as we can rather than trying to put on somebody fake trying to be perfect all the time because you know everybody has mistakes everybody screws up sometimes so you know we really kind of want to just keep this channel us and be who we are for you guys so Alright guys, well, hope you guys enjoyed this video on the new yeah, flavor. Sure. I'll see you at Banger as always. And uh, yeah, be sure to give the video a like, subscribe if you haven't already, and share it with your friends. Tag G Fuel down in the comments below because we're still on that grind to getting a sponsorship. That way we can receive flavors even earlier and get videos up super early for you guys to decide if you want to pick the flavor up or not on launch. And as always, don't forget, stay, stay sipping.